Increasingly, the data is showing that students who don't have college degrees don't do as well. The unemployment rate is higher, they don't make as much money, they're less happy with their positions. On top of that, the, the, the job world and the careers are changing rapidly. So the kinds of basic skills, reading, writing, and mathematics, are essential for people to be successful in their lives and in their careers, to be happy with themselves, to be able to raise families at a level they want to, to live at a standard close or to achieve the standard that they want to have. I think once uh, that GED student comes in, uh, just really set up the attitude of, you know, when you start college classes and really put a positive spin on that and that, you know, lets them know that when they get that GED that that's not the end. You know, that's just the beginning that opens the door to college for them. If somebody's going to go into health care, they need to have an idea. It's not just nursing. There are other avenues. Uh, they can get into and work with computers, um, assist with electronic medical records. They can go into phlebotomy, medical labs, dietary. There are many different ways that they can do that. So we started with an intro to health care to let people know what those programs are about and then give them the opportunities to um, get further education on the different programs. Um, they can go into some of the programs like nurse and assistant. They can go into medical unit secretaries. We have classes on electronic medical records. Um, so we've told them some of the different things they can, can do.